Hello guys, I hope you all are studying your fry words. Um, I sent those home in your packet. So just have mom, dad, sister, brother, whoever's helping you, just mark off after you say it to them at least three times. You know the rule there. Um, today, we're gonna finish on with the story about the magic pouch. I'm gonna go over the words for lesson 52. This is NTI day number 12. This is your reading lesson. The word is rest. What word? Open. What word? Before. What word? Okay, here we go. We have two words. We have road and rod. Remember, the E at the end of the word makes the vowel say its name, so this is going to be a long O. Road. There's no E at the end of this word, so we have a short O sound. So that word is rod. Okay, let's sound out this word here. We have the word grab, but we add ED, and we have grabbed. Remember, we had to double the last consonant because it was a consonant, vowel, consonant. And here we go, we have the word slam. Now we have the word slammed. We have the word come and the word coming. Okay, I'm gonna read these words to you. You have seen these words before. Once, what word? Hanging, what word? Only, what word? Her, what word? Here, what word? And eyes, what word? We have who? Say the word, charm, what word, any, what word, sound, what word, from, what word, out, what word, and called. Oh, you, what sound does that make? You should know, go ahead and say the sound. You said owl, that's correct. Ha owls, a ouch, and ha owls. Okay, today I'm going to read the story to you, but I also want you to take the time after I read the story, I want you to take the time to read it to somebody else, okay? Um, that way, I want to make sure that you get all the words and that you understand, but I also want to make sure that you are practicing your reading also. And I will know when we get back to school if you've been practicing or not. Okay. The magic pouch. Where did the little girl live? Answer those questions in your head, okay? What did the girl want to do? Who told her not to go up in the mountain? Who did she take with her? Where did the girl go with her hound? The little girl and her hound went into the clouds. She said, I cannot see too well. These clouds make a fog. But the little girl and her hound kept going up and up. So think about what, why couldn't the little girl see too well? And did they stop climbing? Yes or no. All at once they came out of the clouds they could not see the ground anymore. They could only see clouds under them. They were in the sun. The sun was in the girl's eyes, so she could not see well. She sat down and said to her hound, we must sit and rest. So why couldn't the little girl see very well? At all at once, the little girl looked up and saw a funny little house. She said, I didn't see that house before. Let's go see who lives there. So where are they going to go? So the girl and her hound walked over to the funny little house. 
All at once, a loud sound came from the house. So what happened? I wonder what could happen or what that was sound was from. I wonder what it could be. So it says more to come. So we know that we're not finished with this story. We're going to have another part tomorrow. Hope you all are staying healthy. I miss you and we'll see you soon.